Hey, welcome to the show. Today I'm going to show you the animal reports that we did here in third grade. Uh, this is my classroom right here. It's a little messy, but uh, uh, we are always having fun in this class. Um, right here is the uh, template for the animal report. You'll see up on the top there I have the description, so they're going to have an illustration with labels. Um, then you have the animal name, animal close-up, adult photo, baby photo, a food chain, life cycle, habitats, with an illustration and then three facts down below. And then if they wanna add something else, they can do that. So let's walk over here and we're gonna see, our first one is the orca whale. This is so cool. The students did a really good job. I just gave them a lot of freedom to kind of go on their own. Um, we did a lot of research. We've been researching the animals for at least, I would say five to six weeks. So they did a, a report on that. Um, they also typed out, look at this, uh, even somebody brought in a, uh, um, I think that's a megalodon tooth right here. It's so cool. I like that. Here we have a gray wolf. And you can see what I'm talking about. They did some descriptions here. Um, if the words were not there, then they would write them out. And then we have our food web. This is really neat. They, they added a lot of color. Here's a gray wolf. And look at this, you know, just the creativity of the students adding in their own personal touch. Brought in some stuffed animals. Uh, right here's our giraffe. I like how they did the letters of the giraffe. Description, color. With the habitat, I had them, you know, draw out the habitat um, or, you know, they could draw it out, color it, or use some watercolors. So this is cool. I like even on the top here, he added the fin. And <laughs> the gray wolf. Check out that balloon. Isn't that cool? I love that. And little cups down here. He has some little pa plastic animals. We have a coyote. Another coyote sticking his head up there. And then they made, they got some, you know, um, toilet paper rolls and they made some some uh, coyotes there. An Arctic fox. I like that. Armadillo. This, uh, the student took, did this at home. Just beautiful. And look at this right here, the habitat. Um, I had some, some sand and stuff like that so they kind of glued that to the board. Here's my monkey head. Northern Pike, yeah, I just love that. I love the background, all the details. Now this student, um, you know, wanted somebody else to do their writing. I said, no, you can do it yourself. And they did a fantastic job. And they also will put some questions right there for, for our uh, people that come up and watch this. This is a life cycle right here. I found this, I think, on Teacher Paid Teacher. I just added a little clip there. The giraffe, look how they did the letters. So cool. So a lot of this, you know, you might want to model. I modeled doing the description and how, you know, how you can be very creative. And then I just let them uh, use their own creative talents from there. And she even, like this, even made binoculars out of some styrofoam cups. We had a bunch of styrofoam cups. It's like, hey, go ahead and use those for, for your art project. Platypus, did a great job on that. The koala, found a paper that she uh, drew, colored, and I love that koala bear there, that is so cool. The black rhino. It was tough to find information on the black, black rhino. There was other rhinos that had information, but this student, uh, did a fantastic job. And the tiger, I just love that. Oh, I like those pictures. I like how he did his, his letters there. It looks like a tiger. And the polar bear, beautiful. Take a look at this here, look at that. This is a Kleenex box, has some tissue and some paint around there. And then this is an ice scene right here. So what I did is um, I took their desks, you can see this, I took their desk, I lined it all around like this, 
Then I found some paper in a closet, and then um, I had them just uh, get on the rug and we decorated the paper. So it um, just kind of gives that little added touch. And I did this yesterday, and the presentation will be today. I was like, uh-oh, where am I going to have the kids study? And then I found some card tables, so you know they're doing all their work in the center of the class. And they are just so excited. You know, it's just a, a change of uh, environment. And they are so excited for their parents. Their parents will come tonight and take a look at their presentations. They're going to show them their written reports. And uh, yeah, it's, it, I'm just proud of all my students here. So hey, thanks a lot for watching the video. Uh, make sure, I would love it if you hit the like button down there. Hit the subscribe button, and like always, have a good day. Adios, goodbye.